What causes wet stacking? This issue was addressed in the NFPA 110 standard with the requirement to load and or load bank diesel generators. The buildup of carbon in the upper cylinders of diesel engines can cause loss of compression and therefore loss of power. The problem is reduced and sometimes cleared up by putting the engine under load for an extended run. The outward signs of wet stacking shows up as gooey black tar-like material that runs out of the exhaust system, the turbocharger, and the exhaust manifold. It gets on the engine and looks like an oil leak. It is sometimes mistaken for a leaking head gasket, but it's usually just the result of wet stacking. Take a look at the gooey black stuff I'm pointing to in the photograph. This gooey residue is the result of unburned fuel and sometimes engine oil that slips past the oil retention ring and then condenses in the exhaust system. It mixes with soot and runs out of the exhaust system looking like dirty engine oil or tar. One of the problems it causes is that it tends to build up on the stem of the exhaust valve as hard carbon deposits. When it builds up enough, it prevents the exhaust valve from closing completely and results in loss of compression and therefore loss of engine power. The buildup happens when a diesel engine runs at light or no load. An extended run under heavy load creates an intense blast of exhaust gases that burns off the buildup. That is why NFPA requires monthly 30% loading and or annual load banking to 75% load. 